This altcoin has <laughs> exploded recently and it seems to be ready to do another 100x. So this is extremely exciting and this is also a brand new incredible protocol. This is called Syncus. So the project is Syncus DAO and here on Syncus.fi, their website, we can see the dashboard here because this is a bit like the old extremely explosive passive income rebase protocols that we saw in the previous bull market guys where you can stake your Syncus into here and receive a 224% APY. This protocol generates revenue. We can see $3.7 million here, for example, every seven days. And they have a treasury balance. And we can see the market value of their treasury assets currently $44.7 million here and growing as their protocol owned liquidity and treasury assets locked inside of the Syncus protocol grows. And it they have a lot of features. It is extremely in-depth. So in this video, we are going to introduce you to this project and the white paper go over how they are revolutionizing their version of the app, the DeFi passive income ecosystem that they are creating. The market cap of their altcoin, Syncus, ticker symbol SYNC, so Sync is the ticker of their coin, here is now a $300 million market cap. As we can see, guys, in just one week, the over the past few days, it did nearly a 10x here. So an extremely explosive bullish pump. And the reason is because everybody's aping into this protocol. If so, if you would like to join Syncus.fi and get your passive income rewards as one of the stakeholders in this treasury backed ecosystem of DeFi for the people, you can earn yield on an appreciating asset like never seen before. Then you can click the links in the video description to enter the DAP and start your Syncus. Syncus.fi journey with your passive income and of course their extremely bullish altcoin token which is currently here on a on an aggressive rampage with a huge pump in fact it's funny I was going to invest in this this was already on my watch list guys because I was going to invest in this token a few weeks ago um, and I would have had about a 20x but I actually completely missed this one so I didn't even invest because I knew it was going to pump and uh, I knew this token was going to be bullish. But yeah, I actually missed it now. And I am aping in late like a degen FOMO. So guys, because of their uh, amazing uh, product they have built. So we're going to go over why they are unique, why everybody is excited about this and why people believe this could be the OM of this crypto bull run. If any of you guys remember, OM was a passive income rebase protocol from the previous bull market that actually made a huge number of millionaires. It lasted a very long time and it it used a treasury backed, you know, um, protocol. So we're going to go over. This is very similar to that, right? But it is slight. But it is, of course, saying that it is improved upon all of the downfalls of Omen protocols similar like that to make it last longer, even more sustainable and potentially stick around to make many more people wealthy. So let's go into this. So this, this is their website. Sinkers is the greatest wealth creation effect of our modern age. They are saying here it is is a treasury backed ecosystem of DeFi products built for longevity and user empowerment. Syncus will continue to reward stakeholders. You simply buy Syncus and then stake Syncus. You can enter the app here and here will take you to their white paper, which we will go over their white paper soon. You can earn yield on an appreciating asset like never seen before. Syncus's mechanisms represent a new era in DeFi guys, right? So it uses simple yet detailed mechanisms to reward stakeholders and drive sustainable sustainable treasury growth. Every trade with Syncus, whether buying, selling, staking or unstaking, fuels the perfectly designed ecosystem, right? So this cycle promotes a steady treasury growth, rewarding the patience of long term holders while profiting on short term traders. So people who sell Syncus tokens contribute to the rewards of those who remain staking with Syncus. So basically, by staking your Sync tokens, you are helping the operational stability of Sync, their token, the Syncus altcoin. By reducing the supply of Sync, you ensure the stability and liquidity of the ecosystem. The more you Sync, the more Sync you stake, I mean, the more rewards you receive. It is a win-win. You earn while supporting the token strength and value. The first protocol where selling is good for the holders. So it's actually funny, guys. You see, the more people sell, then the more the holders of this token will be rewarded with the passive income uh, rewards, right? So how to buy the Sync token is available right here. As you can see, you can actually pick this up on Uniswap using your Trust Wallet or your uh, DeFi wallet here, guys, and any of the other exchanges below. Watch the video tutorial for the easy guide for that. Purchasing via 
buy Uniswap and staking, of course, if you do use Ethereum exchanges like Uniswap, then you can pick up these gems on there. I believe that Syncus has also just been listed. If we go to the Syncus listing here on CoinGecko, guys, we can see, yes, bang, it has been listed on Mexi now as well. So you can actually grab this and you can acquire this on there, over on there as well too, right? So that's pretty cool. So that's a gem that you can acquire on there. So you could just even invest in this and then, you know, hold it on Mexi, for, for example. But the protocol currently earns stakers $300,000 per day. How does the Syncus work? Think of Syncus as a decentralized bank, right? That operates on the blockchain technology. So contrary to popular belief, traditional banks do not earn yield on your deposits by loaning them. Instead, they print money out of thin air every time a loan is issued, as we already know this guy's here in crypto, right? But Syncus challenges the traditional economic theories by decentralizing this power to all of its participants rather than one central authority. So <clears throat> the goal of Syncus is to decentralize the financial power traditionally held by banks, particularly their control over, yeah, particularly their control over money creation. By participating in Syncus, anyone can benefit from the system usually reserved for banking institutions. This not only creates a wealth effect for its participants, but also redistributes financial control to the broader to the broader community involved in Syncus, right? So why do we need this Syncus in the first place, right? So Syncus addresses today's financial challenges where banks fail, right? So uh, especially with rising inflation, it's a dig digital currency that stands strong against inflation, keeping and growing its value right compared to with traditional money so the ecosystem design makes sync as a front runner in the race against inflation rising in value faster than well-known cryptocurrencies like bitcoin or ethereum so where does this staking yield actually come from which is one of the most important questions Syncus yield matches what the treasury is able to offer from the protocol's profits the profits come from the treasury's investments trading fees the protocol owned liquidity and revenue generated from the ecosystem of Syncus products what crypto wallet is recommended for Syncus? So you can use, of course, P PC, so Rabbi Wallet extension available on Google Chrome, of course. Or if you're on a mobile device, Trust Wallet is the best one. And then um, as a suggested option, you could also use, you know, DeFi, the DeFi wallet. But yeah, so that's how they're creating the revenue. And once again, guys, the yield matches what the treasury is able to offer from the protocol's profits. The profits comes from the treasury's investments, trading fees, and protocol owned liquidity and revenue generated from the ecosystem of Syncus project pro products. So all of that revenue is right here, as we can see, on the Syncus dashboard here, it says the treasury balance is 44.7 million. As we saw a minute ago, it's actually gone up here to 44.9 million now. So that is where all the daily revenue is going to uh, get distributed to you, the Syncus holders. And we can see today's daily revenue is $963,000, which is actually quite crazy, right? So the more people sell, then the more that goes into revenue and the more that just gets distributed back to uh, the people who have staked Sync. So $99 million has been currently staked here in Sync, which is pretty interesting. You can come to this page and sync your stake right here. Just make sure you're connected to the correct ETH blockchain. Sync your, or I should say, stake your Sync. And every four hours and 33 minutes here, we can see is the next rebase. Actually, it's four hours and 33 minutes left until the next rebase but every time period of a certain amount of time then there is a rebase now every time there is a rebase that takes place guys here that is when you receive the next reward amount as we can see down here the next reward yield and the next reward amount is going to be seen here as v-sync so the rewards are going to be it shows your staked amount is in v-sync and your rewards are going to be in v-sync so when you stake your sync, it becomes vsync, which is your staked amount. So your rewards are going to be rewarded to you in vsync. So the next reward is going to be 0.069%, which is absolutely extremely crazily high. That equivalence to an currently at an, an ROI of a five day rate of return of 1% or 1.04% right now. So you are you are actually getting 1% of, uh, you know, uh, income, not daily, but for every per every five days. So almost daily, basically, which is absolutely insane saying so if you that compounded over a long period of time guys is a crazy apy as we can see here the current apy of around 224 percent apy uh, okay so that's pretty crazy everybody's talking about this protocol right now on on twitter and everywhere so check that out because i've seen everyone talking about this you know why people are getting excited about this 
new innovative Syncus Bank, this decentralized Ethereum platform. So we can see here on the Syncus Bank, your net worth, your net APY, your supplies, your borrowing or your borrowers and your assets to borrow available here and assets to supply. So you can even supply assets here where you will, of course, earn passive income, extra passive income for them here. So let's say, so it's a bit like liquidity, I guess, right? Let's say you want to supply some liquidity, which is supplying your tokens. You can do that here by clicking supply. We can see you can receive 26% APY on Syncus, 24% on uh, wrapped Bitcoin, 23% on ETH, 25% on USDC, which is one of the highest on stable coins. And you can even borrow those assets over here on the right at these, at these uh, APY rates. So that's pretty interesting as well. We can see a markets overview page over here of all of the four main assets supported across Syncus right now. And of course, by joining and inviting other members of your team, you can receive 9% per commission for tier one active referral of members. So another additional and amazing way there for you to earn even more bonus passive income on top of that and on top of everything here. So there we go. Now, a revolutionary treasury backed DeFi protocol designed to be the cornerstone of a new economic system on ZK Sync. So this has the ZK Sync narrative on the ETH with the ETH narrative also with the, you know, previous momentum wave of DAO and all of those treasury backed assets from the previous cycle. We have the IDO, which was here, the launch, all the details for that, the token information details over here. We can see available sync markets being Ethereum, ZK Sync, centralized exchanges such as Mex. See, their adaptive tax strategy. So the Syncus DAO is designed with a long-term sustainability and longevity of its ecosystem. So to achieve this, we have implemented a, a flexible taxation system on sell and unstaking transactions, which is responsive to market conditions. So this approach ensures that Syncus can adapt to market volatility, maintaining its stability and growth over time. So it has a flexible tra uh, taxation system on sell and unstaking transactions. So adaptive taxation. The Syncus protocol dynamically adjust sell and untaxing uh, unstaking taxes based on the market volatility so during periods of significant price increase we may temporarily increase taxes on sell and unstaking transactions this is designed to mitigate speculative trading and ensure the protocol stability right during market uh, periods of market stability taxes are re-evaluated and will be reduced accordingly so this adjustment is also influenced by the current staking apy ensuring that our taxation policy remains fair and propor proportional to the benefits received by stakers transition to full decentralization at a later stage the formation of the dao will take place once the DAO concludes that Syncus is prepared to operate in a fully decentralized manner, then the protocol's ownership will be renounced and operated decentralized, right? Rabbi Wallet. So to provide transparency and taxation costs, we recommend using that Rabbi Wallet. Rabbi Wallet uniquely simulates each transaction before confirmation, clearly displaying the exact amount to be taxed. This feature allows users to make informed decisions before they decide to unstake and or sell. Encouraging long-term holding and staking, Syncus distinguishes itself by encouraging holders and stakers of its tokens rather than frequent trading, right? So supporting our members, we are aligned with our long-term objectives and the utmost priority rather than those driven by short-term speculation. This ensures that there are holders who see value in long-term participation are rewarded for their commitment. In the Syncus ecosystem, unstaking and sellers are least aligned with our vision for long-term growth and stability. They represent the antithesis of our core principles as their actions stall the protocol's growth and deter us from achieving our collective goals. Liquidity market guide here, how to borrow, right? How to supply your different assets. Mastering the treasury and token dynamics in the bull run of 2020 to 2021 marked as a pivotal era in crypto. New territories of DeFi were discovered, right? A lot of experimentation, active production, and unfortunately game uh, mistakes and game theory had not proven its test of time. So Olympus DAO, which is the OM DAO protocol, promised high yields on staking funded by unsustainable sustainable bonding activities and a dilutive staking process leading to the DAO's decline. These mechanisms were inadequate and it stands as a classic classic case of a great concept that faced challenges of execution. So Olympus DAO did emerge as a groundbreaking project in DeFi, aiming to create a decentralized reserve currency protocol with its native token called OM. Like I said, the concept was to offer this not directly pegged to a fiat currency, but backed by a basket of hard assets like DAI and ETH in the treasury. It had obstacles growing their reserve-backed currency 
currency, how to increase the total amount of OM tokens, right? While making sure each one is backed by the treasury and how to di uh, distribute these tokens. So the founder devised an innovative strategy. The new tokens were distributed to the stakers as the treasury grew, offering a high APY. Long story short, they used bonds to grow the treasury and mechanics and lots of different mechanics. But the mechanics of Syncus is learning from uh, OM's mistakes and the mistakes of all these other predecessors. There's still no one truth or real answer, but before we reach a significant market share, the demand for sync will become, will come from the APY being high, basically. So as we learned in the first chapter, the way to grow and sustain the APY is to grow the treasury. So the ultimate question for sync has also becomes right. How do we grow the treasury? So we have shown that bonds are dilutive and cause issues for stakeholders. However, if removing bonding, we can't sustain a high enough yield to offer an attractive APY investment Investments wouldn't be possible in the beginning, so don't sustain a high enough yield to grow the market share of sync. Liquidity provision is also low revenue activity. Ideally, we would have a mechanism that captures value from the demand on sync whilst not letting it be dis extracted by third parties. What we came up with will change this DeFi landscape, right? Combining the mechanisms of taxation with Olympus treasury distribution, we have created a revolutionary token that will grow its underlying treasury in the most efficient manner. Syncus will introduce protocol taxes for each action such as buying and selling using them to fund the treasury in order to produce real yield to stakers sync will fully capture the value of the attention of the token garners creating a flywheel effect similar to olympus dow on only this time right is you know it is a more sustainable one with high yield more demand volume treasury growth more yield and then more demand as a repeating flywheel cycle so Olympus's flywheel effect halted at more demand as it does not equate to more demand for bonds. However, Syncasis continues as a more demand automatically means that the treasury will grow. So this makes it a far more effective than Olympus Dow systems, which at its height had 4 billion in market cap. To guarantee that each token has actual worth, to put it simply, we employ taxation revenue to replace Olympus's bonds in order to ensure that the treasury develops sustainably and does not artificially lower the token price to let third parties extract value. Success in Syncus is determined, right, by the benefits given to stakeholders, not only the value of the token. This strategy guarantees that stakeholders will consistently receive a return and a profit that corresponds with the token volume and participation of the protocol. Whatever price volatility, this means that even if the price decreases but you stake for a long enough period of time, you are guaranteed your safety rather than worrying about the price of sync, which may increase in addition. The concept calls for a change in perspective on success, one emphasizing sustainability. This will make sure that holders understand this by displaying the rewards that have been given out over time, providing a more precise indicator of success. While the short term Golf for Syncus is growing its market share right and generating revenue for holders the long-term goal is a decentralized treasury backed protocol once Syncus has reached a significant market cap the treasury will make investments into the sync zk sync e ecosystem as well as build out the Syncus uh, ecosystem products on ZK Sync. This is to create a real auto yield generating stablecoin on ZK Sync, a token which you can simply hold to earn revenue from, similar to what we have seen with yield generating chains like Blast. Syncus represents a new era in DeFi, one that learns from the past and builds towards a more sustainable and stable future. Stands out in the DeFi landscape due to its emphasis on rewarding stakeholders, sustainable treasury growth, and innovative self-marketing mechanisms. As the protocol evolves, it aims to redefine what success means in the world of decentralized finance. Built on numerous chains, come to the conclusion that zero knowledge chains are the future. So people do not care about change. They care about low fees, decentralization and security. They have a thesis on ZK Sync here, two layer solutions, where ZK Sync comes into play for Syncus and all of the details on that. The ecosystem, the decentralized monopoly reshaping the public finance. So you guys can read this about banks, high yields, right? how Syncus changes this by having a decentralized on-chain equivalent of what we've been describing. It's like a community-owned bank. Everyone who holds Sync tokens own a part of, a, of the bank, basically, the treasury. Syncus acting like a centralized entity that owns the entire ZK Sync DeFi ecosystem. For customers, Syncus offers uh, lending and borrowing, bonding services, banking services, fiat, stablecoin services, interest rate accounts, mutual funds, brokerages, and exchanges, right? So 
There's a separation of interconnected products as well here, including the products offered to the masses and the products offered to sync holders. The need for a product monopoly, the crypto product landscape and understanding the benefit mechanisms. I highly encourage all of you to do your own research and especially do some investigation into this. One of the most important things about Syncus, which is the game theory. The game theory behind the prisoner's dilemma, which you may have heard of before, we had the Olympus Dow 3-3 strategy. So this was the popular 3-3 game theory from before, which is the stake, bond and sell 3-3-3. Syncus, the Dow always wins. And the two-player model and Syncus, uh, uh, Sync's resilience, right? The Sync trading phenomenon and why this happens. This is how they're going to generate revenue for the treasury. They have this two-player model in Syncus. In a two-player scenario within Syncus, any sale of Sync results in a loss for the seller, but benefits the stakers. There's the two players in the model, guys. A dynamic that ensures constant value flow to the DAO treasury. This model is fundamentally different from a typical crypto Ponzi scheme or meme coins. Even if uh, Sync's activity diminishes, the remaining APY distribution uh, reignites interest, fostering a cycle of revival. This makes the Sync beneficial for the ecosystem, a redistribution. Uh, redistribution mechanism. A better chart for Syncus would be one describing the actions a player takes and the results for, for that player and the DAO. And we can see here a stake, buy and sell chart description um, to be arranged here. The fact that selling Sync fuels the ecosystem through a tax means that a user is missing out on growth they're creating. In addition, selling Sync becomes especially considering that the user also pays that tax. It never makes sense for the person to sell Sync basically. So the DAO benefits uh, the holders, even if the token price remains static, this profit distribution attracts more attention buyers and sellers. So it's really interesting the dynamics of this, guys. Definitely check it out. Investigate, do your own research. This old coin is completely exploding. I mean, just look at that chart. So the market cap is currently $321 million. You could say that this still has potential to do, you know, a 10, 20, 50, or even more um, X return on investment. So this is high risk and high reward. Never invest more than you can afford to lose. Remember, if you would like to check out this project, Syncus DAO, then the links are in the video description. I am not a financial advisor, so this is not financial advice, guys. So remember, always be responsible with your own financial decisions. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Hot Cup of Crypto, turn on the bell notifications because each and every single day here, we deliver the best low cap altcoins, brand new crypto pre sales, DeFi passive income projects, and so much more. My name has been Jordan. Thank you for the amazing support here on this channel, Hot Cup of Crypto, guys, each and every day now. We are growing like never before, and we will see you all in the next video.